Most Planned Parenthood settings are in urban areas. Urban areas that have lots of OBGYNs. Um, now, as it turns out, the folks who don't have access to those cancer screenings live in rural areas. They live in areas where there are not enough physicians. So the idea is that we want someone to have to drive, a, a, a lower income person, drive three hours to a Planned Parenthood facility there to get her screening, or would we rather take that money and put it back in the rural area to allow her to get her health care there? Roughly half of all Planned Parenthood clinics are in areas that are rural, medically underserved, or have a shortage of health professionals. Federally qualified health centers, which provide the majority of medical care in these areas, do overlap with Planned Parenthood clinics at a rate of 92%. And that overlap is what leads some to argue that Planned Parenthood's funding should be redirected to the federally qualified health centers. There's no evidence one way or another to suggest that the federally qualified health facilities could absorb Planned Parenthood's patient population. Plus, it's unclear if they can provide the same level of specialization in women's health care or resolve the access to care barriers for women. 